Welcome back to Let's Play Wario Land. Last time we defeated the evil whatever the hell of Stove Canyon. I have now arrived at the SS Teacup and the surrounding islands. So you can probably guess water levels. Yep, there's a few of them. Balls. Oh, oh, it's one of those levels. Screwed up. Start again. Finally, a child. <coughs> Okay, so this level is a chicken uh, producing level. So you what, I'm going to deal with him in a minute, because this one should probably be done first. Oh, well, there, okay, there's that problem to deal with sometimes. Let's have a look here. Let's try again. Come on, money chicken. Good boy. you got to be careful here, because they can easily fall into that pit of muncher plants ripped straight out of Mario. And then... You'd be doomed. No. 30 coins. For you. Thank you for your time. Now go away. Get lost. Find something else to do with your time. Or something else to spend your money. Neon. Oh yeah, this chicken's annoying because the third coin always ends up on top of there. But what's not annoying is killing this chicken for profit. Quite literally. Ba doing, ba doing. You need to be eaten and converted into thirty coins for my gain and for your loss and your death. You need to come with me. Get eaten by the money producing chicken. What is the deal with that? I don't really know. It's kind of freaky. But you know that you love it. Because it's free fucking money. All the time. Well, until you leave the screen. Section of level, I suppose. Not a big deal. Duck boomerang. Also not a big deal. Did I hit that block? No, it's another like, secret hint. You see, to a hidden block up there. I can't remember if this leads to a secret exit. I'm pretty sure it doesn't, because I don't think this level has one. But it might lead to a treasure, which this level might have. Dragon pot. You can fuck right off with that noise. And don't know quite what those are or why they kill you if they hit you, but they do both of those things. Exist and kill you. Yeah, this is a treasure section. I remember some hidden stuff in some of these. And there's the door. And by hidden stuff in some of these, I mean there's a hidden door under one of them. Just to be annoying. Pretty sure it's this one. Nope. Maybe this one then. Nope. It would always be in the middle, that's why I'm saying no before I've got all the blocks. This one then? Ah, there you go, yeah, okay. It was completely wrong, it wasn't in the middle block at all. But at least we got some coins out of all those. And this will be where the key will be. Some clever stuff to do first, though. And by clever, I mean long winded. And by long winded, I mean jump better. Come on now! Uh, herp -a -derp -a -derp. Now there's water that defies all logic. Oh, that swimming sound has been really messed with. Damn emulators. They'll never get it right. Herp -a -derp -a -derp -a -derp -a -derp 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 Incidentally, I would have started this LP earlier, but um, I was trying to originally record it on VBA, which is a Game Boy Advance one that's gone all to hell because of my overheating troubles. And that had to hurt the ass, anyway. But yeah, this is a different emulator that I had, and didn't think to use at the time. Specifically for just normal Game Boy, and it works pretty well. After some settings tinkering. Anyway. The dagger power-up. And by power-up I mean treasure, because the only power it gives you is the power of greed. Well, Mario's already got that, so he doesn't really need it, but it's nice to have. It fills the collection. Soon, soon, Wario, we will have them all, just like the Pokemon. And then what will you do? Have lots of money, that's what you'll fucking do. herp a derp a derp Anyway, back to the level now that we've dealt with that. See, that's one of the better hidden treasures, I think, because you wouldn't necessarily think to try that. Unless you were really, really secret paranoid. Oh, very nice. My favourite. I don't know what those things are, you can't kill them or anything. Crocodiles, though, you can. They occasionally jump up and then you can... body slam them in midair. 
They're alligators with rubber rings around their necks. I'm not entirely sure why they would need them, but I guess this is a comedy game at heart, so can't really complain about shit like that. You can also sort of turn them upside down. I don't really know why you'd do that. Anyway, this level is over now. And with plenty of coins and a treasure in tow. It's all good. No bonus games, as ever. Bad idea. Because you'll just end up losing all your fucking money. It's only a good idea if you have so few coins to begin with, for whatever reason, that you just want to make a little bit more. Like, if you only got 20 or 30 or so. Yeah, this is a water level, as I'm sure you could already tell. And I hate water levels, as I'm sure you already knew. We've got these dickheads with harpoons for no particular reason. And we've got this dickhead with a giant spike on his head for no particular reason. Also, he's apparently German, because he's called Helmut. Helmut! The German sea urchin! He will kill you. Don't really know what, where that came from. So, we'll forget it never happened. We'll grab this jet pot. For heart points! Heart points are the best kind of points. And then they swim away like cowardly dogs. Because they are dogs. I used to think they are. They're either dogs or seals or some shit. I don't care. He's dead now. The important factor is that he's dead. What he did before dying is an import. Well, that's just stupid. You, you really need to die. Unfortunately, I'm not able to administer that death. I have to. Did you see that? Started out as the jet hat. Glitch. Not really sure how it happened. Don't really care. Burn! Burn to underwater fire death! Science! Science is broken and destroyed. And now I will swap it for the bull hat, because I hate the dragon hat. Hate it! Hate it so much. It ruins everything I ever try and do. And everything I ever try and do is get money! I'm sure you should know by now. It's the main aim of the game. Richness beyond imagining, and you can't get in there without the jet hat. Which kind of sucks. And you, you need to fucking die right, in that, right immediately. You can fucking do. Pretty sure there's no treasure in this level. Because I generally don't put them one level after another. Not sometimes I think they do, but I don't can't think of any examples off the top of my head. If we've already covered such an example and I'm being retarded, please do tell me, and I will promptly ignore you. As people know I am wont to do. Let's see if there's anything interesting over here. Well, there's a dragon pot, a giant coin, I'll definitely have that, and a halfway point. Well, some good stuff. And by some good stuff, I mean one good thing. Save some time. Grab those coins as well. What else has this level got to offer me, if anything? Huh, looks like the beach level all over again. Because we are technically on the beach again. I don't know how you get that one. Probably dragon hat from the other side. It's normally how these things go. Yeah, that's why they give you one. And that's how you get that as well, but I'm pretty sure it's only a heart, so it's not generally worth bothering. So I shan't. That was dumb. Let's see what we can find. I'm a bit quiet now, I realise. Ah ha ha! Invincible Wait, hang on, what? I can't get out of there? Don't be a giant fag, don't be a giant fag, don't make me do stupid things. Like a trap in spikes! Well, that was pointless. Killing time! There should be a hidden block here somewhere. There you go. Always gonna need them to get out of sticky situations like that one! Let me tell you, there is plenty of jam around. I don't really want to get standing in that. It's bad for you. I mean, I like jam, but I don't want to stand in it. That's the point. So, oh, total up our coins again. Oh, I should say, the coin total is not safe. If you have a game over, half your money is taken away. Unless you've got treasures, in which case a random one is put back in the level you found it. Now that really sucks, so don't ever game over is the lesson. Anyway, next time on Let's Play Wario Land, we have this island that needs doing, apparently. So I'll see you all then.